Hey guys, Penny here again. This video covers the water supply to fill valve connection. You'll need just a few tools, an adjustable wrench, and channel lock pliers. Really exciting stuff. Now, if you're replacing a fill valve, you'll need to uninstall the old one. So you'll need to shut off the water supply, flush the water to remove all the water, use the large sponge to get rid of whatever's left in the tank, disconnect the water supply line, and remove the old fill valve. To install a new fill valve like the one we have here, you're going to need a new fill valve from Plumcraft and a hose. It's also helpful if you have a new water supply line if that's what you need to do. Now the fill valve is complete to install right out of the package with its rubber seal. First you'll have to unscrew the mounting nut from the bottom, push the refill tube onto the nipple of the fill valve, insert the valve through the porcelain tank. You really don't want to leak so you have to be careful, but tighten the mounting nut and wiggle it as you screw the nut back on for it to seat well. Just a half turn past hand tighten should do. Do not over tighten. Next, adjust the height of the fill valve by twisting the upper part of the shaft counterclockwise. Then gently pull up until the critical level line is one inch above the overflow tube. Then twist back clockwise to lock it back into place. Push the refill tube into the overflow tube of the flush valve. Then. Connect the supply line from the wall. Just a half turn past hand tighten should do. Connect the supply line and tighten it a bit with the wrench. Open the valve and check for leaks. Thanks for watching our video on how to install a fill valve. Be sure to check out the last video of our series where we install a flush lever. It's super exciting. Thanks for watching. Like and comment below. If you have any questions, leave below. Subscribe to our channel and do it yourself, people. It's not so hard.